Asus has a brand new update for the Zenfone 9 and I want to talk and show you what's new. So let's get started. Let's dive in directly. This is the changelog. As you can see here, not much has changed. We have an updated Android security patch from the 5th of April. We have optimized system stability and number three, provide and press and hold trash can option to one time dismiss persistent notifications. So how does this look like? You can see that I have a persistent notification here of KD Connect and this one I cannot swipe away as you can see here. But to dismiss it one time, what I can do is press and hold and you will see that there's a new trash can option. So I can press this trash can and this persistent notification is gone until it reappears if I restart the device or something like this. So this is one interesting option that we have here. Another option is the new ability to hide the a gesture indicator. So by default, you can see when I'm on the desktop, even we have this gesture um, indicator here. And even if I'm in applications, just like the Play Store, it will always show up here. So if you want to hide it, what you have to go to is the settings. And then under display, you will find the option system navigation. And when you click on configure gesture navigation, you have the new option to hide the indicator. And if I hide the indicator, you can see this white line is gone, completely gone. And you have a completely, uh, yeah, f <laughs> completely full screen, which looks very, very nice indeed. So what do you think about this new update of the Zenfone 9? And despite the fact it doesn't state that there's a camera update, let's try out the cameras as well. So this is now the camera of the Zenfone 9. What do you think about it? Is it focusing correctly? Because we had always this focus hunting issues where it's focusing on the background instead of my beautiful face. And I'm not sure I did not read anything about this in the changelog, but maybe it is working a little bit better. Sometimes they fix stuff and don't write it in the changelog, which is a bit yeah, unfortunate. But yeah, what do you think about this one? I'm using an external microphone that you might see here. That's the Boya mic. And um, yeah, it's a wireless microphone here that I just plugged into the USB type C port. The good thing is since I think the last update already, it's automatically detecting external microphones and recording automatically from them. So you don't have to manually switch to use the external mic. What do you think about the quality here? And is the focus fixed or is it not fixed on the Zenfone 9 here?